This is a 1.5 kVA epoxy encapsulated transformer by Square D Schneider Electric. It comes in a NEMA 3R enclosure suitable for outdoor or indoor use and is mounted on a wall or a vertical surface using welded channels on the back, which I will demonstrate. The welded channels have four mounting holes facilitating the transformers mounting to the wall. Turn it over again. The transformers wiring is done in the bottom quadrant of the enclosure and the transformers will have uh, conduit entries on the front, sides, and bottom of the transformer as well as the back surface. And the wiring compartment is accessed through two plates on the bottom as shown and the plates come off with quarter inch screws that remove the plates giving access to the wiring compartment inside. Okay. The wiring compartment inside also contains a quarter 20 green grounding screw that the ground wire from the system that the transformer is installed in will be attached to. This particular transformer has black colored primary wires that are pre-stripped to be connected to wires that come in through the conduit openings from wires from the outside world with wire nuts or split bolts or whatever your preferred method of wire attachment is. The secondary wires are red colors or red colored and have a similar wiring technique. When all the wiring is done in the transformer the wiring is stuffed back into the wiring compartment and the bottom covers are replaced and the screws are reinstalled which completes the installation of this particular type of transformer. So the transformer hangs on the wall and the wires emerge through conduit openings from the bottom of the enclosure. This particular type of transformer comes in various sizes. This 1.5 kVA version is a relatively mid-sized transformer. They come in much larger and much smaller sizes as well, but the mounting and wiring technique for these types of transformers is the same for all sizes.